Hey guys, sorry if I said that twice, I didn't know whether I was recording or not. Um, but hey guys, I'm doing a new video on, um, it was requested and, um, it's what all my belly bars look like on my, on me and what kind of belly bars I have and I look really white, sorry about that. Um, but yeah, let's get into it, so if I move a bit closer, focus you in, um, right. Yeah, this is what I keep my belly bars in. It's like I've had this for absolutely ages now. It's like a, it's fairly cute. It's like gold around it, like gold print. It's really nice. Um, so I'm hoping I might have like some random, I don't want this to fall over. Some random like beads, like they're not all put together. So um, some of them don't go with others and it's really confusing. I don't know whether that looks even or not, I don't know. Um, yeah, starting off, wait, the one I have in now, I'm gonna have to lift my top up, be a weirdo. Um, the one I have in at the moment is this purple one. Um, yeah, my, as it's um, a surface piercing, um, I got this pierced, I pierced this myself. Um, as it's a surface piercing, it doesn't last long. Um, I've had it pierced for like three, four years now. They don't last long because they're only a surface piercing. Microdermals last longer, that's why. When this comes out, I'll probably get just two microdermals, so it just looks like a belly button piercing. But, um, yeah, two microdermals where it... I don't know, I might just get one microdermal. I don't know. Um, we'll see. Um, but yeah, it's really thin, that's why, because I've had it so long, um, it does, the skin does stretch and stuff, um, but yeah, stuff, I don't know where the top is to this, but, um, I have no clue, what's that? I don't know what that was to either, I don't even know what half of this is for. Um, yeah, I can't find the little top to this, but here's my first one that I've found. <laughs> it's a little cherry. Really cute. Um, so yeah, it's a cherry. Um, it's just a no one. I've had this for like ages now. Um, I haven't worn it in ages, and it needs like a clean and stuff. So um, I might deep clean all these. Um, it's just a cute little cherry. This cost me... I don't even know where I get my belly bars from. I completely forgot. Um, I'm just going to start off with the really cute ones. Um, oh, shit. I've lost loads of my things. Do I think that goes in there. I don't even know where these all go. Shit. I've only just realised this is like my cutest one. I've just realised it broke. It was a little flower cute thing and I just wondered why that was there and I just realised it stuck on like that and um, it was a really cute belly bar. Great! <laughs> Great! Um, and then I'm going to show you my glow in the dark ones. Where's the top of my glow in the dark? Yeah, most of them are not even together. It's really annoying. Um, Mom. So let me just get all my glow in the dark ones together. It's really annoying. Um, I take the tops off them and then like, I f can't be bothered to put back on. Um, yeah, these are my glow in the dark ones. I've got. I dropped two of them. Oh, here we are. Right. Here's my little glow in the dark ones. And they're so cute. Right. First off, I have my green glow in the dark one so cute look at it and um then i have my sorry if these are a bit dirty the box got really gross i don't know how but um yeah there's my orange glow in the dark one my blue glow in the dark one my yellow glow in the dark one and my pink one I prefer the blue one, but um, I don't know whether I should show you all of them in because it would take forever. But I will show you 
at the end of what it looks like when I change it. But um, here I have just a normal black one. I don't know where the top of that one went. Um, here again I have just a black one, like a black dotted one that's like a marble type thing. Um, then I have like the bottom of it which is like a purpley, it looks black but it's actually purple, like a really dark deep purple. Uh, there you can kind of see the purple. I don't know. Um, then here I have like a sort of corally one. I don't even know where the tops of these ones have gone. This is so bad. I think I found the top of the coral one. That's a bonus. No, nope, it's not. Um, yeah, there's a top of one. Um, then I've got the bottom of a blue one. A big blue ball one. Then I have... Oh yeah, I remember. I These two went together. Like It looked super duper cute. It was really nice. Um, yeah, that was like... Oh yeah, and here's another one of my favourites, I've completely forgot to show you that on the start one. It's like a little gecko. Look how cute that is! It's like a pink gecko, it's so cute and yeah. I used to wear that one all the time, but um, yeah, Bob. <laughs> um, this also was another one of my favourites, but I don't know where the top one. Oh, that's a shame. I think I used to just switch like the pink one at the top, but um, yeah, this is my glitter, glitter one. There, yeah, my glitter one. I don't know about the top one. I think I just used to switch the tops. Um, I'm gonna have to try to speed this up. There's a pink one, pink top, sort of like multicolored one. Um. Pink one, um, pink. I mean purple. Um, sort of like a. I never really liked this one because it was really heavy, and I think this is what made it rip. Um, but yeah, here I have like it's like a metal sort of weird pattern to it. Um, oh wait. And here I have, so I can put the two blue ones together so I can show you what it looked like. You know, the two blue ones that I literally show you, showed you just a minute ago. Um, here. That's what it would look like. That's how I used to style them anyway. Um, then I've got just another little blue marble type thing. Then I've got this really ugly green one. I wouldn't wear that personally. Um, sorry about that, I had to go speak to my mum. Um, this is just like a really weird lime sort of green. Bit weird. And here I have, oh these look really cute. Um, here I have just a white and a sort of hot, yeah, hot pink one. Um, I'll show you how I change them, I don't know which one I should change it to. I have this purple metallic -y one in at the moment. Um, yeah, I've got high-waisted uh, le legging disco pant things on at the moment, um, I don't know what one I should change it to, I think I'm gonna change it to, I don't even know, this is just great, isn't it, you know, um, oh god, I don't know, they're all so pretty, um, Wanted to switch and change them. Get off. Okay, maybe not. Um. I'm gonna change it to this pink one. Is it clean? Cause once you've um wore your belly rings after, try clean them and keep up with it. I think I'm gonna put in my green one, my luminous green one. Um, so I'm gonna have to stand up for this. Right, put you down. Right, um, right, you focused, right, put belly ring down. Like, my belly's all healed now, like, I can move it around and stuff. Like, I don't have any sort of like problems. 
Which was it? Yeah, this one needs cleaning. I haven't taken this out in like months. So what I do is I sort of like press on the bottom and twist, but it's there. Twist, twist, and sort of like make sure you make it like a dome around it. There. Take the ball off. Grab that. Pull down. Oh my god, this needs cleaning. <laughs> Who has any trouble with them? Like, you need to keep up with the cleaning, but like, it's healed now, so I don't need to like clean it. Clean it, I just clean it in the shower and I might go to the bath and stuff. Um, but if you want to keep it still clean, then go right ahead. Um, so take your new belly ring. Oh, yeah, this is what the hole looks like. Um,. Yeah, if you've got like a fresh piercing, then um, I'm gonna try show you. Um, so you don't, cause you're probably gonna be scared to change it for the first time. Um, so sort of like push it up. Like I already find the hole like it doesn't hurt me, but like if it you're like a fresh piercing, obviously it's probably gonna hurt you changing it. But um, yeah, what I do is like sort of just find the piercing, find the hole. Um. Sort of push up like so. Keep pushing up till you get to the end, and then like that, leave it. Um, find the hole and line it up with the belly piercing. Line up. Oh god. Um, line up. Okay, it's not working for me. Line up. Twist. Twist. Twist, make sure it's so do the whole the same thing again but twist it the other way. Um so you're gonna like when you undo it you're gonna be twisting it uh that way. Like that way. You're gonna be twisting it yeah, that way, and when you undo it wait. No. When you undo it, you're twisting it that way. Yeah. And when you're putting it on, you twist it that way. If that makes sense, I don't know. Um, yeah, I have like a tank top underneath that just to keep me warm. Um, that was me changing my belly bar for you, um, showing you my belly bar collection. Um, and yeah, um, in my septum piercing video, I was going to show everyone what it look, um, what the piercing kits that I buy look like, um, Basically, they come with like a needle. I brought the one with the cannel needle. Um, the double-sided mark pen here. It's double-sided. As you can see. Um, hollow clamp. As you can see. It's like the automatic clamp, clamp one. So, it's like... Right, let me show you there so sort of lock it yeah you get the idea um but yeah i hope you enjoyed this video um that was all my belly bars um if i do get more then i will show you um but yeah hope you enjoyed guys bye oops i've got to press the off button um hope you enjoyed guys bye hope you enjoyed it this video guys bye